Albion Keith Paris January 19, 1788 to February 11, 1857, was an American politician and jurist of Maine. Paris served in many elected and appointed positions throughout this life, including state legislator, U.S. Senator, the fifth governor of Maine, state Supreme Court judge, and mayor. Topic: <inaudible> Biography. <inaudible> <inaudible> Paris was born in Hebron, Maine, then a part of Massachusetts. His father, Samuel, was a lawyer and officer of the Revolutionary War and was one of the first settlers of Hebron following the American Revolutionary War. His cousin was Virgil Delphini Paris, also a politician. Paris entered Dartmouth College in 1803, graduating in 1806. He later studied law and was admitted to the bar, beginning practice in 1809 in Paris, Maine. In 1810, he married Sarah Whitman, the eldest daughter of the Reverend Levi Whitman of Wellfleet. He had four daughters Caroline, Helen, Julia and Sarah and two sons Albert and Samuel, all except daughter Helen survived him and son Albert W. Paris was a lawyer in Wisconsin. In 1811, Paris became the Oxford County Prosecutor. From 1813 to 1814, Paris served in the State House, from 1814 to 1816 he was a member of the State Senate. On March 4, 1815, Paris began his term as a U.S. Representative from Massachusetts, elected as a Democratic Republican. On January 27, 1818, Paris was nominated by President James Monroe to become a judge of the United States District Court for the District of Maine, the seat having been vacated by David Sewell. The appointment was confirmed by the United States Senate the next day, and Paris resigned from Congress on February 3, 1818, to assume his judgeship. In 1819, Paris was a delegate to the Maine Constitutional Convention. He served as a judge until January 1, 1822, when he resigned to become the governor of Maine. Paris served as governor until 1827. That year, Paris was elected to the U.S. Senate, serving from March 4, 1827, to August 26, 1828, when he resigned to become a judge on the Maine Supreme Judicial Court. Paris served as a Supreme Judicial Court judge until 1836, when he became the second controller of the Treasury. Paris served in this position until 1850. In the fall of 1846, he served as one of the three commissioners negotiating a treaty at Washington, D.C. with the Winnebago Indians. In 1852, Paris became the mayor of Portland, defeating Whig incumbent Neil Dow. He did not seek re election and launched an unsuccessful bid in 1854 as a Democrat to become governor. He was defeated by Know Nothing candidate Anson Morrill. In his later years he was an active member of the High Street Church and a Sunday school teacher. He died at age 69 in Portland and was interred at the Western Cemetery. Removed to Evergreen Cemetery, 